This isn't us! I am done fighting, Steve. She's pulling a Steve Rogers in The Winter Soldier. Today we're here to watch What If Captain Carter Fought the Hydra Stomper. This is the first ever episode to be a continuation from season one, so I'm excited to see how this kind of works into the story. So without further ado, let's check this out. The Battle of New York. Captain Carter. Oh, so everything plays out just her instead, huh? Wasp? Cool. This is like the OG Avengers. Or we could just punch him a whole lot. Mm. <laughs> What's the point of revisiting the story when there are infinite stories to be told? Yeah. You know you could join me one of these mornings. Running in circles has never been my style. <laughs> yeah. I found what the pirates were after. Okay, so this is the post credit scene. Cool. The Hydra Stompa? Yeah. And there's someone inside. Steven Rogers. Is he gonna be like the new Winter Soldier, kind of? Okay. Yep. Not Steve. More like Robocop. Yeah. That was cool. <laughs> yep, Steve. I guess Hydra found him. After the war, Rogers and Barnes formed their own. <laughs> it's Samuel L. Jackson. Cool. There's been rumors about the Hydra Stomper's survival since the 1960s. The 1960s? <laughs> it might be better for you to sit this fight out. I'm Peggy Carter, and we're talking about Steve Rogers. Exactly. Peg, the Steve Rogers <laughs> that you loved died in 1953. Not true, not true. Bucky, if you'll permit me, surely you understand that the Sokovia... Is that Alexander Pierce? I won't have a country torn apart by civil war. I don't think so. I can handle myself. Oh, the Hydra Stomper's coming for him. I guess that shield is gonna stop it. Who's in the suit? Bucky, it's Steve. Steve. Steve's in the suit. Oh, Bucky. What's oh, wow. Well. It kind of looks like him. Damn, that was cool. Oh, snap. I feel like that thing can take out a jet. Not when there's two of them. Okay, maybe. <laughs> Damn it. Get down. Oh lord. Sir, I'm locked in on the target. Weapons hot. Wait out! No. Fire. Please get down, sir. No, no. Steve would be stupid enough to do the same for me. Steve, hey. Sir, I don't have a Oh my god. Let's get a drink. Like the old days. What do you say, buddy? You I feel like this is gonna be too easy. Uh-uh. Oh my god. Damn! Okay, Peggy. What if he just dropped you? Oh snap, he powered off the suit. Oh, they're gonna land in the jet, that's cool. Wow, that was close. I'm a sucker for a good love story. <laughs> that's funny. You can't remove it? Not unless you want to put him straight into a coffin. <laughs> then banner? No. Unplugging it and plugging it back in is not gonna work. Hey, that would be cool if they brought in Stark. Best case scenario, he winds up stuck in some prison frozen in carbonite. Frozen in car carbonite? So that's how you spend your Saturday nights. We'll go to the Red. She likes Star Wars. Steve. Peggy, that's not Steve. Oh, snap. I owe you that date. 
Steve. Is he just like playing the part or is it actually him? Not too far from the red room. I guess it's actually him. Unless he's just leading them into a trap. You smell that air? What the heck? Even the news moves fast. And uh the dancing? Still slow. <laughs> I hope they have a, a dance at the end of this episode. Ah! Peggy! Widow bites. Packs a sting. Oof. Oh my lord. Yeah, that's creepy. Oh my god, she just sliced that baby in half. That's cool. I'm not gonna lie, that's cool. Widow, nice. Why does that thing keep powering off? Yep. There it is. I think I can see my bedroom from here. Oh. <laughs> we turned your bedroom into a gym. Molina. So they haven't settled their beef yet, huh? Mission accomplished, ma'am. I freaking knew it. You never struck me as a child foolish enough to buy into fantasy. I don't like this version of her mom. Oh my god. Okay. See, how did she not get hit with any bullets? That's ridiculous. There's a lot of slow-mo in this episode for some reason. Damn. That was nice. Nice move. Uh-oh. Hmm. Well, they're not dead. This is kind of cool. They're doing like some real secretive spy stuff. Like that. Maybe if you hit him hard enough, he'll forget. Oh, didn't you do that in the first episode? Damn, that's your own child. This isn't us. I am done fighting, Steve. She's pulling a Steve Rogers in the Winter Soldier. Okay, maybe it's working. Um, no. He's gonna sacrifice himself and bomb the red room. Wait, no, wait, wait. Oh my god! They never got their dance. You see him tied around her. Yep. Wow. Steve is always the one to make the sacrifice play. Maybe he survives, because isn't the Hydra Stomper very strong? I don't know about that strong. This isn't the end of her story. Again? I observe all. I know. What is this? What is happening now? That's a good question. Yo, what? I'm excited now. Was it Stephen Strange, maybe? Or like Supreme Strange? That is she. The one who can save our queen. More. She will save our world. Ugh. So much. Wanda? Watch her. Watch her. Oh, yo, she asked for his help. That was cool. What a way to end an episode and connect it all together. I love that. I'm going to be brutally honest with you here. The ending of that episode just saved the entire thing for me. It's not that it was bad. I still enjoyed it. It's just not like anything I was... I really cared about. I understand. It was just very similar to like the Winter Soldier, you know? And 
I feel like the thing with what if is that we want things that are so different from the main MCU. That's also why I didn't care about last week's episode because it was very similar to Ragnarok. They just kind of switched the characters, which again is cool in theory, but I want like completely new scenarios and team ups. That's why I loved episode two because we got like an old timey kind of golden age of Avengers versus Peter Quill with celestial powers. Like that is just, mind-blowing and awesome and i want more episodes just like that but yeah i enjoyed this episode i thought it was fine uh the ending jet definitely intrigued me and i am very excited to see what happens next i think all the episodes uh to come are gonna start connecting and start uh you know coming to like a big finale just like last season which is kind of what i wanted so yeah with all that said i'll see you guys next time